Hi guys, this is Linda at 360 Aquatic. We're back with another store tour. Going to give you guys an update on all of our livestock and new things that we've brought in recently. We've got some free magazines for when you guys want to come by. It's got really neat information about different aqua escaping tips and how to do things. Over here we have our spider wood. This is a sale we have ongoing right now. It's $5 for every piece. You can kind of pick out your own, see what fits in your scape. Uh, here we still have some red dragon flower horns and king compa flower horns. Up here, good sized black mollies with gold neon tetras. We also have a lot of fire red shrimps, bloody mary shrimps. Um, here is our Caradina tank, black pintos, red crystals, pure red lines, and chili rasporas in that one. Here we have scarlet baddies with um, baddies, baddies, potato, patata. Um, here we have the stone catfish. These are really neat. That's the biggest they get. Great little nano fish. Um, these are the green jade shrimps, blue dream shrimps. Here we have neat little nets for your shrimps. And then um, little feeding plates here, pots, mini decors, and all of our shrimp food, shrimp king. This one's a, this one's a very good one right here. We got crabs down here, red and gold call crabs, black rose shrimp, blue jelly shrimps, black really shrimps here, and then more blue jellies up there. Of course, our decor rack for all you guys that want some hideouts for pistos or rams or just something that's spicing up your tank. Um, bonsai trees on the bottom, some betas, some shells for your shell dwellers. Uh, here we have our beta wall. All nice and clean. We have some sales on some of these. You might find a gem, 75% off, 50% off. And we also brought in like 50 new betas, uh, both the males and the females, which I'll get to. We also have a nice sale. These are all the free betas right here on the fridge. Come and pick out your free beta, guys. It's gonna be um, one beta per household. So there you go for anyone trying to start a little bit in the hobby or just, you know, you have space for another beta. Here's our planet tanks. We got a light shipment of live plants today which we got in there large amazon swords and also new discus still in quarantine but look at those guys gorgeous all these discus you'll see will be absolutely gorgeous there we go neat little baby dwarf tier mats first time i've seen those more plants for you here and of course more discus up there large Amazon swords at a great price. You guys gotta come in the store to grab those. More plants, tangerine mollies or tangerine leertails, some people like to call them. Great algae eaters, they'll tackle brown algae, etc. Got neon cardinals, a whole bunch in. These are hot sellers. We got a bunch of kind of like a niche nano fish in this tank, like Daddy Duck Daniel, Sparkling Garamis, Emerald Eye Rasporas. More plants. Here we have our female beta sorority. We got like 50 new females. Really beautiful placats here. And then we got Rominos Tetras. Here we have Basmani rainbows, emerald rainbows, glass fish, uh, Embraer tetras, and Madagascar rainbows in there. We have our Ember tetras here, and um, these are gonna be the Rasbora hengeli, and also we have some Burmese spotted loaches. These guys are great algae eaters. More of those guys in here. In this tank, we have the scissor tail Rasbora and leopard long fin daniels here more of them and then some asian rummy nose right there there's a, a good amount of uh, like six or seven of them in there if you guys want asian rummy nose here we have white platinum rice fish and we have some 
silver tip brass tetras, little guys right there. Um, we also have medium sized Odessa barbs with some snakeskin inlers in this tank. Here we have Pistella tetras, um, hydrocotyl mats, hydrocotyl Japan mats there, and a lot of Amanos, Amano shrimps everywhere you see them doing their little job. And then we have the Epistol sunsets in this tank. Let me just grab this stool. Need this for a better view. Here we have small size Congo tetras, some blue rainbows. Um, I think we have some Kamaka rainbows in here also. So there's that tank. And then obviously large Amazon swords. Very nice and bushy. Those are at a great price, guys. Here we have our penguin tetras. And then we also have orange sparkled rice fish. It's a really neat little fish that we got in. In this tank, uh, we have some dwarf cichlids with some uh, bristle nose plecos in here. Glass catfish. Some uh, pretty good sized harlequin resboras. Here we have what looks like red phantoms, if I'm correct. And some Gertrude rainbows, fork tail rainbows, and gold tetras. This is gonna be our sort of rainbow tank. Uh, we have the black phantom tetras in here, all by no millennium rainbows, blue rainbows, um, and also we have diamond tetras, which are gonna be those uh, sparkly little boys right there. Over here, uh, we seem to have banjo catfish, which are kinda hard to see, because they like to bury themselves in the sand there. Um, but we have some, I think this is a type of uh, dwarf cichlid, yeah, it's the golden dwarf nanakara cichlid in there, those little guys right there. Here we have the Priscilla maxillaris with bamboo shrimp. Of course, our glowfish tank, glowfish tetras, glowfish danios, and then we have the elegant quarries right there, you can see one sifting in the front. Black ruby barbs, New Guinea red rainbows, Madagascar rainbows, yellow rainbows. <coughs> um, excuse me. Moving on. We have um, yo yo loaches here, yo yo botias. Great at eating pest snails. We have some more black ruby barbs here. And clown plecos in this tank. There's one right there. Here we have white blushing tetras with some red frontosas. It's gonna be like those guys right there. More hydrocolor Japan mats. Um, here we have a pistol Hong's loy. And we have a few of these guys left. The Limias. And then the same thing on this side. Grab my hand stool. We have small Rosaline sharks in here, albino uh, tiger barbs, and then obviously green tiger barbs right there. Some uh, gold barbs too in this tank. All right, moving on, we have all of our fertilizers. Thrive medicine here, a whole bunch of medicine for you guys all the way to the top. Huge selection of medication. Down here, Zym7, shrimp starters, your regulators. There we go. Just a bunch of stuff for when you're starting tanks or just needing stuff to help your fish out. I'm gonna rotate over here. Small assorted angelfish. Here we have red tail catfish and like two green spotted gobies left. In this tank, we have our honey garamis, and then pygmy corridoras. These are the herbosis, and then peacock gudgeons, along with um, these are the albino lemon bristlenose plecos. And then I'm gonna need a stool again, of course. The cons of being short, cannot record without a stool. Um, here we have uh, giant danios, 
some green scats, African bush fish, and then orange chromides. There we go. We have the spotted silver dollars in this tank, and then red tail um, sharks in this one. Dwarf garamis, um, mainly powder blues at this point. And then some dojo loaches are hiding in there. I think we're running low on those guys too, which we will get uh, some more soon. Neon tetras, uh, these are gonna be, is it the sunset? Sunset garami, yeah. And then uh, small assorted angelfish again. Moving on, we have some Stratia botia loaches, and then some Sanodontis jupiteris, and then I think like one one tiger knife back there, which he's hiding next to that uh, bubbler. Here we have the leopard catfish. It's like a hybrid between a shovel nose and a red tail. And then some dwarf giraffe catfish in that corner. In this tank, we have our medium clown loaches, blue garamis, gold garamis, Parkinson rainbows, small Basmani rainbows. And I think that is mainly it for that tank. Yeah, we also have um, moonlight garamis in this tank, which are gonna be those guys right there. Here we have German blue balloon rams and von Rio tetras. In this tank, we have our red bala sharks and an assortment of paradise garamis, albino bichers in this tank and ornate bichers. Here we have our um, cute little pearl scale goldfish or oompa loompas as I like to call them. In this tank, we have Aranda goldfish. There you go, for you goldfish lovers. Koi. More goldfish. And then we have our rancher goldfish in this tank. Up here, we have an assortment of uh, peacocks. Look to be about three and a half to four inches. In this tank, slightly larger, around five inches. More peacocks. More cichlids, kind of like an assortment down here with the lunas, frontosas, uh, random Mosca over there, yeah. More assorted cichlids. This is gonna be peacocks now with that flower horn in there. Up here we have our assortment of baby embunas. Beautiful coloration on these guys, very active. Huh. Our black piebald tank, venusis, yellow-sided peacocks, haplochromus obliquidens, and I don't think we have any, maybe one or two eastern happies in there. More peacocks, an assortment of course. These are our uh, sorted embunas. I think with some peacocks mixed in there now, so just assorted cichlids here, mainly embunas it looks like. Large Mbunas, we have a special sale, $25 for these guys. Smaller peacocks, there you go. Smaller Mbunas, we got some white, uh, white Sokolofi, some red zebras, I think some cobalt blues in there. Here we have our clown knives, the Bali cats, looks like some Bala sharks in there. Um, I don't think we have any. Some Leporanus, it seems like. Frontosa Burundi, also Frontosa widows, Burchardis, Neo Lamprologus. These are uh, Neo Loopy oranges right there, and then some Trophias de Boise, those guys with the blue spots. Maybe that uh, Lake Tanganyikan tank. More Mbunas. These are the gold Trophius Cholumbas. And over here we have the yellow tail acai, some Kenyan cichlid pears, and the Haplochromis nyerere. In this tank we have large pakus, large clown loaches. Do we have any more red flag tails in here? I think we do have like two or three left, so that's that tank. Another Lake Tanganyikan tank. 
with Rashardis and Lamprologus multifaciatus. We've got um, small size Sturbi Cories there and an assortment of Nerite snails. Here we have some Redfin Borrelis and I think these are Caputo, Caputo cichlids. Can't remember exactly. And over here, some gold Trophius Cholumbas. These are our small clown loaches with some Aurelius barbs in there. Our display tank, of course. Here we have Congo Tetras, good size, with also albino Congo Tetras. And we have Polka Dot Picus Catfish. Here we have red tiger oscars and pike, pike fish. These guys are very aggressive. Here we have gold severums, cherry barbs, albino quarries, and wild caught pearl garamis. And then of course our silver arowanas. These guys, I think, are the uh, gold plecos with some purple mystery snails. We have some green phantoms, blue phantoms, and royal broken striped royal plecos in this tank. Here we have an assortment of cichlids. These are mainly green severums, uh, some cribs, some drools, our blood parrots, and wow, these guys came in with so much color, and they're looking amazing. Here we have the blue-eyed cichlids. Oh man, look at that blue. It shows up really well on camera, even better in person. And here, oh, so these are the Caputo cichlids. So the other ones were not Caputo. Those are, I'm not entirely sure, but we'll have that name soon remembered. Lots of fish to remember. We got Kerbensa cichlids, uh, Jewel Turquoise in this tank. Uh, what else? Looks like some geophagus. They might be. Uh, it might be the Ceramensis, it seems like. I'm not entirely sure on that one either, but that is that tank. Here we have black diamond cichlids, green Texas cichlids, Jack Dempsey's, and pearl cichlids all in here. Here we have our high cover red koi angel fish. About baby size, really. Here we have rainbow cichlids, keyhole cichlids, um, good size Rosaline sharks. Here we have our red spotted gold severums along with emerald quarries and geo vegas redhead tapajo. That's them. And then an assortment of medium sized angelfish. Here we got our large discus, still in quarantine, of course, but. These are amazing size, beautiful coloration. Look at that. Amazing. And then down here, wild caught discus and an assortment of other discus. These are um, ready for sale. So if you guys see anything you like here, you can come and pick it up tomorrow or whenever you're available. Here, an assortment of aggressive cichlids. We have chocolate cichlids, Cuban cichlids, Salvini cichlids, uh, green terrors, uh, some blue acaras in here, so a whole lot of them. These are gonna be tiger mosaic dumbo ear guppies with some dragon mixes in there, some half black Moscow guppies. We have Julie Corys over here. An assortment of male guppies right here. And then in this tank we have small size polar convicts mixed with some Texas parrots. And this tank, an assortment of platies. This tank, we have our balloon mollies and more tangerine leer towels. More platies. More platies. We also have uh, Galaxy as plecos in this tank. Here we have the electric blue acaras, angelfish, and some, I think these are the gold spot plecos. Here we have daisy blue rice fish, and um, I can't remember correctly. These are the these. Where are they? 
the albino bristle nose, and then those are Colombian zebra plecos over there. And then we have black koi guppies here and super red bristle nose. You can see them in the back over there. Blue coral platies, tiger platies, and galaxy mixed platies. Curvaceps acara cichlids with Bolivian rams and port acaras. And then we have butterfly plecos on the over that wood there. Here we have peacock bass and tiger shovel nose catfish. Guppies, these are gonna be the half black Moscow guppies mixed with the golden spear tail inlers. And then an assortment of female guppies. So we have the full female guppy tank here and the full male guppy tank over there. Moving on. An assortment of locally bred guppies with black neon tetras and Siamese algae eaters. 24K gold minnows with large blue German rams and some celeb Madaka rice fish. We have some um, baby sized red shoulder severums like over there you see them all stripy boys. Those guys are neat. And some small curbinses mixed in. More discus. These are also in quarantine. Here we have some red glass barbs, some salt and pepper quarries, and gold mystery snails. Our celestial pearl danios and blood fins in this tank, along with our rabbit snails. More discus. Here we have our red and blue Colombian tetras with some autos in here. They're all hanging on that wall. Also, there are red phantoms in here and bleeding heart tetras. Blue tetras mixed with white cloud minnows and gold barbs, it seems like. <clears throat> More discus, of course. Uh, these are locally bred guppies with some coolie loaches. These, it's like an assortment of emperor tetras, inlers, coolies, Gertrude rainbows, and then of course, more discus. So this whole row right here is dedicated to discus. And of course, our food, an assortment of a lot of different foods, different brands, dried goods. <clears throat> My voice is giving out on me. Ooh. And then little knickknacks for you guys. Stuff like Purigen, Epoxy, Aquascaping tools. We have aquarium salt, a whole bunch of stuff back here. Automatic feeders, nets, etc. And huge selection of wood here. More wood. Filters, sponge filters, all of them right here. And then of course our tanks. Got some nice rimless right over there. <clears throat> we have our feeders, fronds, rosies, botanical section, alder cones, almond leaves. Here we have the quarantine section where of course we make sure your fish are nice and healthy before they're moved out into the floor. But that will be, for the most part, everything covered. Of course, substrate. We got our rocks, plastic plants. Pretty much anything you guys can think of. We pretty much have it here all crammed into this store. More wood all the way down. Not wood, sorry, rocks. So I hope you guys enjoyed the store tour. Hopefully you saw something you wanted. Come by and check us out at 360 Aquatic. See you guys next time.